YouTube, what up? It's your boy Splash Sticks coming at you with a vlog video. So, wanted to knock this out. I'm tired as hell. Been on the road. So, uh, ran across an interesting topic on accident today. Uh, me and my girl, we went to uh, Lexington today. Well, yesterday, last night. Just got back today. Uh, anybody knows me, know her. She is like the biggest Kentucky fan ever. So, uh, they was having a little meet and greet with the team, you know, you know, they just won a championship, whatever, you know, uh, some little spot in the mall, and, uh, Lexington has a house of hoops now, so, I was talking, I went, while she went and did her thing, I went to the, down to the spot, to the house of hoops, and, you know, get into the story, I had these on today, so, I'm looking at something else, you know. Guy came up to me and he was just like, he worked there. So he'd been working there for like three years before when it was just a regular full locker. But he asked me where I got my Harachis from. And I was just like, man, I had to go the eBay route, but I got them for retail. And he was like, oh, that's what's up. So you ain't on that hype beast stuff. And I was like, nah, partner, ain't nothing about me hype beast. You know what I'm saying? I get what I like. And he was just like, Man, that's cool, you know what I'm saying? Because that ain't a hype these shoes got on. And I was just like, yeah, you know, it's it's a classic to me. And he was like, yeah, he was looking for it. So, I got I, I asked him, I was like, what, what, what's, why, why are you talking about hype beats? You know what I'm saying? You, you in a business where basically they, they, they feed you, you know what I'm saying? He's like, no, nah, I ain't talking about that. He's just like, I see some true blue sneakerheads that have turned to hype beasts and I don't think they know it. So, you know, we get to going back and forth, you know, like, what, 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 where you going with this, right? So, it goes up and since I got the shoe, I'll show you. He goes and picks this LeBron Hornet up and he goes, this is a non-hype beast shoe. And I said, why is that? And you know, I'm trying to take his temperature, he's trying to take mine. He was just like, because it's on our shelf still, you know. Everything, he said, everything that's high beast related, you know, it's gone. As soon as it dropped, you know. And he said, he remembered before it was a house hoop stuff would stay on the, stay on the shelf a little bit. Maybe a week or two. And I was like, yeah, I get that. I mean, I go through that now with like St. Louis area, you know. You got a, a, a house of hoops in Fairview. You got one in St. Louis. You know now you know like St. Louis is on the map, so they got a sneaker following now. But um, like I said, dude was trying to take my temperature basically, and I was trying to take check his, you know. And he was just on some like this is what I'm gonna say. He was like, there's some true blue sneaker heads that have been here since I worked here that only buy hyped up shoes now, and he said, to me, that's being a hype beast, you feeding into the hype, and I was just like, you know, maybe they buying what they like, and he was just like, nah, just, just, just vibe with me real quick, and he was just like, what's the, what's the number one shoes out, and, you know, of course, we're gonna say Jordans, LeBrons, Kobe's, KD's, and then, so going further along, he was just like, if you got the Chicago 10s, the, uh, what else, the Cement 4s, and, uh, the playoffs, this, that, another. Yeah, he said, that's cool, but he said, I mean, didn't get the 14s. And, you know, that made me, that took me back a little bit. And he said, how many didn't get the Bordeaux? It's like, okay, so, he said, if you're a sneakerhead, you're a sneakerhead. You know, I get that. You buy, choose what you like. And, let me just pause real quick. Only reason why I'm doing this video, some insight, you know, maybe somebody, because I'm not agreeing or disagreeing with dude. Like I said, this is his point of view. So I just bring it to the table of YouTube and we can talk about it like that. But, um, yeah, he was just basically like, then he went to, he, he took it to the LeBron's. And since I got it still in my hand, he was just like, Big Bangs, uh, 
like what else? Free gums, all that stuff. He was just like, now he, he said people like LeBron. He said, I bet the people that got the big bangs and etc. 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 didn't get the LeBron lows or these. He said, in my book, you are high beast. And I was just like, wow, you know, like I know a lot of people that had those shoes, you know what I'm saying? And before I get pissed that you call him a hype beast, he was just like, man, you know, I work at a sneaker spot, so I can spot a hype beast in a in a minute. And you know, I I didn't know which way to take that, like. But then he, I mean, he, he kind of opened my eyes up to something. He was just like. What's the most hyped up shoe this year? It's like, you know, the phone, phone posit, Galaxy joint. And he was just like, all right. He said, now take the Galaxy, take the metallic red, and take the electro line. He said, I guarantee you, <laughs> only the real fiends, the real sneakerheads, got all three. He said, I'm sure, because the electro limes, they still had a few pairs. He said, now these set the metallic reds in the galaxy, you know what I'm saying? And, uh, you know, he, he was kind of getting me to nod my head to it. And then the, the, the icing on the cake was, we get on the KDs. And you know, they got the new orange, white, and blue joints that just came out KD wise. They still had them, full size run. But he was just like, if we would have put, if they would have said these KDs something, 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 they wouldn't be here, so what's the deal? So, like I said, I'm just putting the video out there. It's just a vlog discussion. Um, leave them comments. Tell me what y'all think. Uh, like I said, I'm not agreeing, disagreeing. You know what I'm saying? I'm just putting it out there. I did shoot a video, a comparison video yesterday before we left. Um, got busy, forgot to upload it, so I'm gonna upload that one after I do this one. Like I said, basically, are sneakerheads becoming hype beasts and don't know it? That is a question. I'm looking for answers and feedback. The ball is in your court. Until next time, peace.